wife of the president of Nigeria, Oluremi Tinubu, has met with wives of the 36 state governors to formally introduce and acquaint them with the objectives and mission of the Renewed Hope Initiative. The meeting was held at her office at the presidential villa Abuja. The first lady who was meeting with the wives of the governors for the first time since assuming office congratulated them on the successful conduct of the elections which brought their husbands to office and reminded them that it is time to keep promises made during the elections. She assured the governor's wives that the Renewed Hope Initiative, a pet project of the Office of the First Lady of Nigeria, will in no way interfere with their personal programs and projects and that she believes that support would be impactful. The mission is towards a better life for families. The goals, one, to ensure women in Nigeria are engaged in productive activities that contribute to the social economic development of individuals, communities, and the nation at large. Two, to increase opportunities for women, youth, and children across the nation. Speaking with newsmen after the meeting, Ambassador Olufolake Abdurazak, wife of the Kwara State Governor, assured of the willingness and commitment of the wives of the governors to support the Renewed Hope Initiative. So we have a lot of take home. Uh, you have the first lady, so all the uh, state first ladies are here today. We listen to the mission of the Renewed Hope Initiative. We listen to all what uh, we're planning to achieve. And uh, so now we're very geared up to go back and get all the things uh, that we've highlighted done. We will select, as you heard, um, students for scholarship. We will also go and intimate our local government chairmen, their wives, their women leaders, and all the other stakeholders within the state on this initiative and how it will roll out in the state. We'll also now, as you heard, uh, pick our zonal coordinators, um, you know, all the zones of the country. We'll pick everybody uh, to one person to be the chairperson of, the, of each zone, and then that person will coordinate the affairs of the zone. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.